What are we doing here? What the heck are we doing here? Lost in the heart of the Andes. We carry our kayaks like mules at the bottom of a gorge. And it's getting dark. So I ask you, what are we doing here? You never know the outcome of a kayaking trip. But it always begins the same way. Load, unload, and leave. Meet up with an old friend, load, drive, struggle. Load again and again to travel far away where nobody goes. And ending up alone on the shore, fitting your whole life in a kayak. Not easy. We embark on the Apurimac, the farthest source of the Amazon. Apurimac! For 400 kilometers, self supported. From now on, there is only one way possible. The river. The river and nothing else. The river to sleep. The river to eat. The river to wash. And the river to travel. Wild, furious, and sometimes hazardous. But why the heck are we come here? We came here for the thrill of running big rapids. To live in this unique magical moment when you don't have to think about your move. Everything becomes instinctive. We are like animals and we are hungry. What are we doing here trying to tame this ferocious river? Yep. It swallows our kayak. The struggle. It's the struggle we came looking for here. Away from the comfort of our secure societies. The modern man paradox. Or the art of putting yourself in a crappy situation to feel alive. So, we let the river take us away from the wall. What the heck are we doing here? So far away.
have we come here for? We've come here to remember we could live together, modestly. <laughs> Every day a new camp. Never the same place. Nothing lasts. Everything is in motion. We are a tribe. Nomads. With the river as our only home. What have we come here for? We've come here to remember the wild tale of the war. To remember that spared by man, nature does well. We came here to remember it doesn't take much to be happy. We came here to remember happiness fits in a kayak. And a kayak is tiny. Yeah.